In 2016, Sydney Miracle was running on the beach with her sisters. She loved horseback riding and other sports, but near the end of her freshman year, something changed. I would get a terrible stomach ache after I ate anything. And for months and months, this just got worse and worse. Now, wherever Sydney goes, so do three different tubes. She can't eat or drink anything on her own. And for over a year, nobody knew why. They sat me down time after time and said, there's nothing wrong with you. You, it is in your head. Your head is making this up. We didn't have a direction. Uh, we'd go from doctor to doctor and it was, nobody had a diagnosis. Until one day they found a specialist with an answer, median arcuate ligament syndrome or MALS. My diaphragm sits too low, which in turn cuts off an artery and creates severe inflammation, which takes away my ability to eat. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. With an answer came a direction. The family designed clothing to spread the message. Pain is real, but so is hope. There's people now getting tested for this condition because of sweatshirts. More than 400 items were sold. Thank you. They've raised more than $7,000 for Mal's research. You create a whole different kind of appreciation and thankfulness when you're going through something like this and people reach out to you and they're like, we want to help you. And while she is no longer horseback riding, Sydney is focused on the future. She flies out to Connecticut Sunday morning for a surgery that could have her eating by next week. For every one thing I've learned I can't do, I've learned 10 more things I can. When she kicks this thing, she will be unstoppable. While the clothing drive has ended, the family encourages people who would like to help to donate to the Mouse Foundation in Sydney's name. You can find the link on fox6now.com. In the newsroom, Cassidy Williams, Fox 6 News.